girl, it's a girl. Seriously, it's Zara. Today on Commercial Commotion, we are going to be testing out the famous Maybelline New York Fit Me Foundation. This foundation is to mattify, mattifies, mattifies, and refine pores. Matches natural tone and natural seamless finish. So when I was getting this at the store, the woman in the makeup department was uh, giving me more info about this foundation. Apparently, this becomes more darker and more yellow or red, depending what shade you get, once it's oxidized. Now I know this happens with most foundations, but I guess this one in particular has more side effects, I guess. I don't know, we'll see. So I got my beauty blender ready, and I'm gonna start priming my face with the Urban Decay Quick Fix. All right, so for now, I'm gonna apply half of my face and compare the foundation with my nakedness. I guess I'll just dump some on my wrist. I think this has a scent to it. It smells really nice. It does look very natural. It's just really hard to tell or really hard to judge this foundation due to this lighting. Right, I can't really tell, but I'm gonna do the rest of my face now. Okay, so right off the bat, while I'm blending this, this does look a little lighter than my usual shade, but, but again, the makeup artist warned me that this gets darker after a while. And the way I try to find a good foundation is looking at good color and a good coverage. Right off the bat, the coverage is actually pretty good. If there's anything I hate more, I hate when it looks like you have a mask on due to really dark foundation. That's how I feel like right now. I don't know, can you guys see that? I don't know if you guys can see, and I, even I can't tell because this lighting is a little weird, but I feel like this looks a little dark on me. I really can't tell. Okay, so obviously I can't make a full-on review at this moment. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna end this little half of the video at this moment. I'm gonna go set my face, but I'm gonna be taking lots of pictures. I'm gonna check up on my makeup um, to see, you know, if it needs a touch-up or, if, you know, if anything goes wrong. So yeah, I'll be back tomorrow for my final thoughts. Okay, so it is the next day, and I would have to apologize for yesterday. The lighting isn't really the best in here to to kind of look at makeup, so I didn't really get a really good observation um, for the foundation. So I'm going to throw up a uh, picture or two. I checked up on my makeup yesterday about a couple of times, and with better lighting, I saw that this foundation is definitely matte, but it has a very natural complexion to it. And it was a good color for my skin, thank goodness. I took this photo about five hours of wearing this foundation, and I think that maybe a little bit came off, but it still looked pretty good. It didn't crease on my skin, and actually for the most part it did cover my pores. The color was also still intact. It didn't look yellowy and all that stuff. It didn't look darker. It looked perfect. So overall, I think that this foundation is pretty good. And I would have to say that this is commercial commotion approved. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video today. Please don't mind if you subscribe, follow me on the rest of my social media. Leave comments down below and give this a big thumbs up if you like this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.